This video is sponsored by GSP North America. Over 35 years of manufacturing CV axles, loaded strut assemblies, hub assemblies, and much more. Visit gspnorthamerica.com for more information. Before you get ready to put the new axle on a vehicle, it's critical to understand why the first one failed in the first place. A couple different things can cause an axle to fail. This damaged sway bar link, well, it can come in contact with a boot and cause it to fail and be ripped and torn. Look for evidence to see if the vehicle has bottomed out at any time. When the vehicle bottoms out, well, the joint is at extreme angles and this could damage the boots and also the insides of the joint itself. Make sure you look at the condition of the exhaust system. Pay attention to any heat shields and also the hangers because excessive heat near a CV joint boot can cause it to fail prematurely. Also, take a look at the wheel bearing and also the brakes because excessive play in the wheel bearing can cause damage to a CV joint and cause it to eventually wear out over time. Before you install the part, make sure you're looking at the entire suspension to make sure there's nothing there that could possibly damage that new axle on the vehicle. This prevents a comeback and helps to keep your customer satisfied and have that repair last a very, very long time. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much.